What up, bitches? It's the misanthropic one, aka He Who Hungers, and I'm back up in this bitch for another rant slash review. Today I want to talk about this album right here, Logic's latest album titled Everybody. All right. Um, shout out to my nigga Logic. Uh, he's a dope rapper from the DMV area. Um, I've talked about him on previous. Um, videos so go check those out um, probably one of my favorite mainstream rappers very lyrical um, has mainstream appeal without sacrificing too much which I like which is what I would like if you're a mainstream rapper at least be, be lyrical have some type of uh, content you know shit with substance um, he is probably one of my favorites, you know, along with, uh, you know, Joey Badass, Kendrick Lamar, J. Cole, because those guys, they, they're mainstream, but they have substance. They got something to say, and their, their beats are great, and, um, well, you get, the, you get the fucking idea. Let's jump right into this, okay? There's the artwork right there. You got a, a sort of like a Last Supper deal going on right there. Um... Logic is there uh, on an MP on an MPC right in the front right there and he's repeated all over the place this looks like it's a Last Supper type of shit uh, in the middle of a Coliseum with um, some type of robot uh, statue and the robot sitting in the middle over there and uh, Logic is, if you look, it's like a Where's Waldo thing. He's repeated throughout the crowd. Um, so go look for him if you want. Um, on the back, that's how the back looks. 13 tracks. Um, this is being presented, I guess, as a concept album because it's Logic Presents Everybody, starring Neil deGrasse Tyson and Big Von. All right? Let me get this shit out so I can show you the inside. All right. Same shit right here. Same shit on the back, okay? You open this bitch up. And you have the drawing of that uh, robot right there. Um, let's see, hold on. I'm going to show you the CD. Let me pull this shit out of here. Fuck. Dude, I might end up eating this fucking whole CD by the time this video is over. There's the CD right there. Put that bitch back in there. Pull out the book. There's the book, and um, there's some of the shit on the inside. I'm not going to go into everything, um, but he breaks down. He doesn't have the lyrics, but he breaks down um, what each song is about, which makes this review kind of easy for me. All right. Um, let's go into some of the production on here okay all right so you have 301 productions who's who's uh on here a couple times okay hold on 301 productions you have six six who's on here um bu -bu 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 -bu. six and logic logic produces his own shit you have pstmn i guess that's postman um vante thomas 
You have Bobby Campbell. I'm, I'm skipping because six is repeated on here a bunch of times. You have Dietz. Come on. Uh, of course, you have No ID. Um, that's one of the dudes that actually um, helped put him on No ID. Shout out to No ID. That's a Chicago legend right there. Uh, uh, Seasick and DJ Khalil. Okay. Um, Wallace Lane. Uh, da, 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 da. Everything's repeating right now. Yeah, so that's it. Okay. Um, yeah, so uh, production wise, it's, it's kind of clean, you know, like, like Logic is used to. It's very clean, um, not too gritty, like the underground dirty dirty that I love, but it's clean and I respect it uh, because it, it, it complements his style, you know what I mean? Um, features on this bitch, hold on. You have uh, Ansel Elgort, you have um, Killer Mike. Um, Killer Mike doesn't really, uh, he just does like a outro sort of thing to that song. You have uh, the legendary Black Dot from The Roots. Um, you have Chuck D, uh, the legendary Chuck D from Public Enemy. You have Big Lenbo and you have No ID actually rapping on, on one track because he hasn't rapped in a while. Um, you have Juicy J, Alicia Cara, and Khalid. You have Lucy Rose, Damien Lamar Hudson, and uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson, who I mentioned as, um, you know, uh, one of the guys that says it's starring him. He plays the voice of God, and uh, Big Vaughn plays Adam, A-T-O-M, which is the um, the uh, android or robot, whatever you want to call it. Um, you, uh, I believe it's the robot, but it, it plays a. You listen to the to the to the background story, and you'll see what I'm talking about. He's a. Um, uh, he's a man, but every man, I guess. You know, I, I don't want to ruin it because it's it's kind of a, it's kind of a good uh, way of looking at life. For those that listen to this album, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but meat and potatoes of this shit, like I said, um, Logic isn't one to stray away from subject matter, which I like. Um, he's lyrical. Um, definitely has a fast and slow uh, and soul flow, but he definitely use, uh, uh, utilizes the fast shit a lot. Um, on here, what I love, um, he, uh, without even looking at this, fuck it. What I love about him, especially on this album, he touches upon a lot of social issues. You, you know, a lot of rappers are going that way today. Um, it's kind of easy for people to do that shit. Um, but him, I could relate to the most um, because me personally, for those that watch my rants, who, who follow me because they like my rants and my shit against society and all that shit, um, I could relate to, to him on this record a lot because he's not, he's mixed. A logic he's black and white so he sees things on both sides of the coin and he's not playing a victim too much you know what I mean um, and uh, you know uh, there's there's other rappers that I like their music I like what they produce but I don't necessarily agree with a lot of the things that they say some of y'all know what I'm talking about I'm not gonna turn this into that type of video but you know what I mean and I like the fact that he says you know what um, he's just sick of the racial bullshit um, whether it's black whether it's white 
um, how he wasn't accepted, um, how he was taunted from both sides. I, I fucking love that because um, even though I am black, um, I've talked about this. I talked about this earlier today. I did a video with my man O'Shea Duke Jackson um, about my origins of me getting on YouTube and I felt the same exact way that he did even though I'm 100% I'm black. So um, I can relate to that a lot. Um, but I will go into some uh, tracks here. There's one track in particular. Hold on. Uh, he has a track called Black Spider-Man, which is about um, breaking stereotypes. Um, even though I... <laughs> I do not want to, I mean, there already is a black, what is he, uh, half black, half Dominican, uh, I believe he's half black, half Hispanic, uh, Spider-Man, Miles Morales, um, so you do have a black Spider-Man, um, you have Afri Africa, Africa, Africarian, that's how you say it, and like I, like I mentioned before, um, he even says it on here, um, this record was written from the perspective of various biracial individuals, including a white mother who was given birth to a mixed baby and as such has been disavowed by her parents. She experiences domestic violence in an on and off again re relationship with the baby's father. Um, I mean, this shit gets deep on here. Um, A killing spree he says here I'm speaking on the state of society and what we focus on in the world of technology today this song is about social media and effects it has had on us as a human race I mean I can relate to that I've said this before on my channel that people have become very impersonal you know when you're when you're always got your face buried in your cell phone and shit um, yeah so I can relate to that too um but I'm not gonna ramble on and on. I got other videos to make, I got other shit to do. But my rating of this album, I'm very proud of it. Um, this year's, this is a very strong album. Um, I think his next album, he alludes to it on here that it's gonna be his final one. But I don't know how true that is. Um, you know, cause a lot of rappers say, oh, I'm gonna make my last album, but if you got the bug in you, you're gonna write. Um, but my rating of this shit right here, I would probably give it an 8.5 easy great album shout out to my nigga logic um everybody else y'all know the deal leave your love leave your hate most of all subscribe support dope shit and um that's it peace bitches